Aw, thank you. Thanks for coming. Bye. Have a good day. Thanks, guys. Aw. Thank you, thank you. So nice. Bye. All right, let's look at one more. Let's look at some cookies. Ooh. Oh. Cookies. Fluffer nutter cookies. I think fluffer nutter means it has marshmallows and peanut butter. Is that true? Yes. That is what it is. Fluffer nutter. So this is a great example of how in English we make up words. We just make words. <laughs> we, <clears throat> we just make words. We make new words every day. So fluffer nutter. What in the world is fluffer nutter? <laughs> so I can say what is fluffer nutter and I know fluff means like fluffy, fluffy, and I can see in the picture there is some marshmallow, so fluff is marshmallow fluff, and nutter is talking about peanuts, peanut butter. So, this is a marshmallow. <laughs> oh. Marsh. Mellow. Fluff. Peanut butter cookie. Marsh. Mellow. Fluff. Peanut butter cookie. <laughs> yeah. So, great example of how we just make words in English. We don't have a word. It takes a long time to say a marshmallow fluff peanut butter cookie. So, we just say fluffer nutter cookie. <laughs> yeah, sounds good if you like marshmallows and peanut butter. <laughs> awesome. <laughs> All right. <clears throat> I have some more pictures. Ooh. We can say Sumatran owl. It's from Sumatra. What else can we use to describe this owl? Hmm. How would you describe this owl? Black. Great. It's a black owl. They said it's Sumatran, which means it's from Sumatra, Indonesia. Serious. Yeah, we could say serious. It looks serious. Yeah. I think it looks wet. It looks like maybe it was raining. Wet from the rain. Big eye. And we can also say its eyes are yellow, so yellow-eyed, yellow-eyed, yeah. What do you think? Do you think it looks nice, scary, um, friendly, scary, friendly, nice? Hmm. Friendly. <laughs> I hope it's friendly. I think it looks friendly, but I don't know that I would go very close to it. But maybe it's friendly. <laughs> yeah. Excellent. Great adjectives. All right. Let's see. Okay. <laughs> what are they doing? Owls are not known to be mean. Yeah, no, they're not mean, but they are very um, serious and 
maybe their claws. Their claws can hurt. They don't want to hurt, but they're sharp. Sharp claws. Yes, wet. Let's see. Enthusiasts take part in an attempt to set the country's record for the largest number of people dousing themselves with icy water to mark the end of winter in... I'm going to say it wrong. Krasnoyarsk. Krasnoyarsk, Russia. <gasps> Yeah, that looks very cold. They are probably already cold because it's winter. We can see the trees don't even have leaves on them. Oh. And now they are dumping icy water on themselves. So, yes, they are wet. I think it looks a little funny. looks funny <laughs> maybe it looks I think that looks scary I don't want to do that or uncomfortable cold cold I feel cold just looking at it <laughs> cold Sparkles. Oh yeah, there's sparkles too. <laughs> Usual. Okay, so Vladimir, are you from Russia? And what do you know about this? This is in Russia. They are dumping icy water on their heads. This is usual. Is it normal? Is this normal? Do people always do this? <laughs> Ooh. It looks cold. I think some kind of yeah. It's some it, it yeah. It says <clears throat> yes. We I learned that Russian word yesterday or Sunday Saturday. <laughs> yes, they are trying to set the country's record for the largest number of people dousing themselves with icy water. So they are trying to have the most people water dump water. So it's not normal. Ooh. No. I never dive in the holes in the ice either. <laughs> okay, the astronaut says masochism. That means you are hurting yourself. Yeah. 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 No. No. No, thank you. No, thank you. <laughs> That's dangerous. Dangerous. Yeah. <laughs> no, thank you. That's for me. Okay. <laughs> Let's talk about this guy. <laughs> Can we describe this guy? <laughs> She's looking at him like, what? What are you doing? <laughs> oh, okay. A long story with the church. <laughs> All right, it says a man wearing a bathrobe rests on a bench in the center of the Ukrainian capital of Kiev on a warm spring day. <laughs> relaxed, yes, he is relaxed. Just a little bit bigger. He's relaxed. He looks like a stereotypical Mexican guy. Very interesting because he is in Ukraine. Very interesting. Oh, okay. <laughs> and it says it's warm, but these people are all wearing jackets. And he is only wearing shorts and a robe. Maybe he is cold. He looks react relaxed. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> 
I think he looks funny. It's funny. And maybe he <clears throat> is an outsider because I think he's just trying to be funny, right? Oh, okay. A stereotype of an evil guy in an American movie is a bald man with a beard. Sometimes, yeah. A lot of <laughs> a lot of American movies have a bad a bad guy. They are bald and they have a beard. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> that's funny. All right. <laughs> let's do let's do one more. Ooh. All right, one more. This is the last one. I'm going to read it. A boy wearing a mask <clears throat> poses for a picture during belly Poklad carnival celebrations in the village of Lazovic, Serbia. On March 1st, 2020, Bel I don't know how to say this. Belly Poklad, Poklad has its roots in old pagan customs and is marked annually seven weeks before Easter. Children walk through the village to collect eggs and at the end, jump over a fire to banish evil demons. Woo! Okay. Creepy. <laughs> yeah? Looks a little creepy. Creepy? I think it's interesting. Dark. Yes, it's a dark photo. He looks pretty serious. Or maybe he is thinking about something. Dirty, yeah. <laughs> Creepy, interesting, dark, dirty, yeah. So these are all some <clears throat> maybe not so nice words. <laughs> yeah. Weird, right? Weird picture to end on. It's some tradition. Yes, exactly. It's a tradition in Serbia. They are collecting eggs. Yep. So just like Halloween in America, we get some candy. Yeah, he's getting something. So, <laughs> yeah. He's wearing a mask. His mask has feathers. <laughs> hmm. <laughs> yeah, very cool. And he's a kid. He's just having fun. But they made the picture look very dark. Right? Awesome. Cool. Well, guys, I think um, that's going to be it for today. I have some other stuff to do today. Um... But thank you, thank you, thank you. Just a little refresh. We learned about adjectives. There are many kinds of adjectives. We talked about quantity, opinion, size, age, weather, shape, color, origin, material, and purpose. And you all had some excellent ideas of adjectives. Thank you, thank you. And um, some people wanted to learn about countable and uncountable nouns. We can talk about that some more. And if you have something you want to learn, just let me know. You can write a suggestion in the box. Um, say hello to your mom. <laughs> Thank you, everybody. Well. Wow. Thank you, thank you. So if you are not following, please follow. We're almost at 50. Almost there. Whoa, that's crazy. Thank you, guys. Um, and I will see you next time. Have a great day or great night, wherever you are. Yes, we, yes, I should be here on Saturday. I was sick, so hopefully I'm trying to do, do really my best with. Saturday and Monday. So we should be good. Saturday. 
I will be back on Saturday, which is March 14th. March 14th. Awesome. Awesome. Thanks, guys and girls. Thank you. Thank you.